Hello everyone, welcome back again. My name is Jesse and in this wonderful and exciting tutorial, we're trying to see how to work with Snap. So Snap is another option of installing your apps or your programs on Linux. Apart from using apps or your normal package manager, you can also use Snap. So let's see how to work with Snap on your system. So we have the official, official website, snapcraft.io, and you can come back to the store and then you can check and find for the package that you want, right? If I search for audio, I can get these particular Snap apps there. Now, in case I want to install any of them, you can also do the same thing from the terminal. So let's see how to do that. So I'll come back again to my terminal. And first of all, in case you don't have Snap on your system, by now, if you are on Ubuntu from version 16.4 and up, you have Snap already, right? So in case you don't have it, you can just go with sudo apt install Snap. D, right that is how to install it in the system in case you don't have it right by now i know everybody has it so to check if you have it available in the system just go with snap dash dash version right so this is going to specify that okay you have snap so this is the official snap and this is the download diamond there right so in case you want to install it you just go with this option in case you don't have it in your system perfect that is simple now let's see how to find packages on snap so to find packages go with snap then you just go with find then you put in the particular package so let's go with audio if i go with audio as i search for audio here and i got these files i can also do the same thing and get the same result consider i have all of these various results here right perfect so the option is snap find right i can also check what list i want to get for media player so media player going to list all the media players there a lot of them i can also check for something like let's say git i can just take it out of the quotation and just go to git so git kraken and it's going to specify them perfectly and the check mask here green means that it has been verified by snap craft authority so that means that it's safe for you to install perfect let's see how to install a particular package on snap so to install the package just go to snap then snap let's check for the package you want so audacity is the name of the package you want and now you have audacity here so we see that audacity is available so in case i want to install it i can just go with snap install audacity right so by this i can get it installed on my system so let's ask for the permission and now it's going to fetch and then install the various things Perfect, so that's installed everything perfectly for us, right? And it was very fast. Perfect. That is how to work with Snap, right? Okay, so to get more information about the package that you want to install, you can just go with Snap, then info, then you just pass in the name of the package, right? So I go with it's going to give me a lot of information. It's going to give me the name of the package. As you can see, it's giving me the name of the package from here, the summary, the publisher, the where it is stored, right and you can also see the various channels right per the release date so stable candidate beta edge perfect using the info now in case i have i've already installed it as you use as you saw so i can just check for it audacity and now it's going to open perfectly for us right and so now this is audacity okay this is my first time of installing it perfect so everything is going to work as expected okay so let's get out of here yeah so it was installed perfectly right so i can search for it here also and it's going to come if i come back here we have audacity here right so it has been installed perfectly on the system okay that is how to install it on your system to see all the available packages on the system that have been installed with snap just go with snap list so it's going to list all the packages there so you see that the audacity that we installed is found here you have the bear and the core these are fundamental ones you have fire voice have these ones they have slack installed with snap perfect you can also get more information apart from this to get the specific different versions you have on it so list that's that's all so it's going to give you more information about it right so you have fire voice different versions the updated versions and the rest so in case you want to update a particular version right so if i go back here we have this so i want to update this i can just go with snap then refresh 
So now passing the particular packet. So if I pass in it, it's going to check and see if there's an update, then it's going to refresh it, right? There are no updates. So that is how to update. So use uh, this option here to update it, right? That's the basic understanding, right? In case I check for, let's say I want to check for Slack. It asks for the password, then there are no updates. So that is how to check for update or not just check, but update your packages. Okay. You can also disable it. As you could see, there were some, if I go back again to the list here, right? There are some notes here, right? You can actually enable and disable it. So let's say I want to disable this. I don't want to dis uninstall, but I want to disable it. I can just come back again. So snap. I can just go with sudo snap. Anyhow, this is snap and then enable or disable. Let's disable it. So disable this able audacity. You can also do it like this. You can also do sudo. Still going to work. And ask for my password. And now that's going to tell me that okay, this has been disabled. And as you could see from here, right, there's no information here, but if I run it again, then now it has been disabled, right? So you can actually disable and enable a package using Snap. So you can see it very, so here it was, there's no information, but now I have disabled it, right? So you can actually disable it. In case I also want to enable it, I'll just go back again, the same thing. So enable. Now it's going to enable it. So I go back again and I check it out. It has been enabled, right? Very nice. Let's say you don't want the package, you want to remove it, you want to take it off. You can easily go with this, so snap, right? Then the name of the package that you don't want. So let's say I don't want the particular package, so it's going to be remove, then Audacity. Audacity. That is how to remove it. So with Audacity. This is going to remove it perfectly, but in case you want to remove it and then also page it, you just go with page. So this is going to remove every snapshot of it, right? But remove is going to remove it from your system. Now it's going to disconnect and then remove it from your system. That is the basic overview of how to work with Snap. So thank you for watching the tutorial. So the commands are you can install, you can find the package. With this option you can install you can check information you can list everything you can refresh to update and you can also remove and disable so thank you for watching see you another time stay blessed bye